In Ecclesiastes 3, the Bible says, For everything there is a season, a time to be born and a time to die, a time to plant and a time to harvest, a time to cry and a time to laugh, a time to grieve and a time to dance. My season here at WYMT has come to an end. It's been my privilege and honor to serve you in these mountains that I love so dearly. During the last four decades, I've met so many wonderful people. I've made lifelong friends inside and outside these walls. I've met many of you on the best day or the worst day of your lives. We've prayed together, we've cried tears of anguish, and we've cried tears of joy. I ran into a lady not long ago and she asked if I remembered the day her home almost flooded. I did. I remembered standing in her driveway as we watched the rising water inch closer and closer to her home. We stood there and we prayed together for her safety and prayed that her home would be spared. Thankfully, it was. There are countless more memories like that one. This journey has allowed me to share your inspirational stories of hope and survival and you have inspired me. You have also inspired countless young reporters who moved to Eastern Kentucky for their very first jobs. They moved here knowing very little about our region or our culture, but they quickly fell in love with these mountains and our people. Throughout the decades, we've seen the good times and we've seen some unimaginably hard times and we know that more hard times are on the way. And each time we support one another with a helping hand, with love and compassion, because it is an Appalachian tradition, neighbors helping neighbors. As you've heard me say so many times before, we do it because that's what we mountain folk do. We show love through our prayers, our energy, our time, and our money when needed. As one of my Harlan County classmates wrote, it is who we are. It is our way of life. We are Appalachian by name, by nature, and by choice. I don't know what the future holds, but I know this. WYMT's call letters mean we're your mountain television, and that will not change. And for me, this is not goodbye, but thank you. I want to thank all of the people who I've had the honor and the privilege to work with here at WYMT. You made me better, and you are what makes WYMT so, so very, very special. You are what makes this a mountain family. And I want to thank you, the viewers, for trusting me and WYMT for nearly four decades. It's been my honor and privilege to serve you, and wherever this road leads, I will continue to fight for Eastern Kentucky and I will fight for you and these beautiful mountains that I so dearly love. This isn't a journey that we walk alone. We walk it together as friends, as neighbors, as one big mountain family because again, that's what we mountain folk do. And I wanna thank my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ because without him, none of this would have been possible. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you and I love you.